In this video, I'm going to show you how you can show a PowerPoint presentation as well as camera view in the same screen while you are sharing your presentation in Zoom. Let's get started. I'm going to use a free software called Webcam Viewer. The link is in the description. This tool has one unique feature and that is if you click on the settings, it has an option, keep on top. And if you enable this option, what happens is that the web camera view will always stay on top of all other windows on the screen. You can remove the borders around the window by clicking on this arrow over here. And now it is just a camera view and it is on top of all other windows, which means when I'm moving through the slides in the PowerPoint presentation, the camera always stays on top. Let's see how we can use this in a Zoom meeting. This is my Zoom client and I have just started a new meeting. If I want to share a PowerPoint presentation or any other content with the participants, I will click on the share screen button. Make sure you are sharing the desktop. And before clicking on the share button, make sure also that the optimized screen sharing for video clip is enabled. Normally, when Zoom does screen sharing, it uses a very low refresh rate in order to keep the video clear. By enabling this option, you are telling Zoom you want to see the screen as well as video at the same time and Zoom will adapt accordingly. Needless to say, this requires a very strong internet connection. Once you click on the share button, the participants will see your desktop. Open the PowerPoint and start the webcam viewer application. Select the right camera if you have multiple web cameras connected and choose the resolution that you would like to use and click start. And the camera is on. You can move the window around, resize it. And if you want to get rid of the borders, click this arrow, adjust it accordingly. And now you have PowerPoint as well as a web camera in the same screen. Now you can start your presentation and the audience will see both the presentation and the camera view at the same time. As you move to the presentation, you can move your camera around. You can make the camera view smaller or big. Once you are done with your presentation, click on the stop share button and you will be back in Zoom. When you stop sharing and return to Zoom, you will notice that the web camera view is still on top of Zoom window. Close it by clicking on this arrow and then close the window. And now you're back in Zoom. I hope you found this video useful. And if you ever have to do a presentation in Zoom where the audience needs to see both the presentation and the camera at the same time, now you know what to do.